Last year, 53-year-old Carmen Stangoda began suffering from fatigue, muscle spasms, and slurred speech. Eight months of testing, six different doctors from primary neurologists, uh, ear, nose, and throat, endocrinologists. The father of four from New Jersey was finally diagnosed with Lyme disease from a tick bite that didn't show the most common symptom, a bullseye-like rash. It impacts all the things you take for granted that you do every day. Other symptoms include headaches, fatigue, and muscle aches. Dr. Lori Handy says the number of ticks and tick-borne infections nationwide is on the rise, likely due to climate change. Ticks can survive uh, in different areas because it's warmer, and that then can lead to more infections in humans. To prevent an infection, doctors recommend wearing long clothes and using bug spray with DEET, changing and showering once home, checking your body in a full-length mirror, and throwing your clothes in the dryer. If you do find a tick, you should grasp it with tweezers close to the skin and steadily pull it out.